in March of 2020, I decided to uh, try my hand at raising some of these uh, Heteropoda David Bowie uh, Malaysian Orange Huntsman spiders. And it did, it took about a year to uh, for them to reach maturity. There's the, uh, the female. And here's the male. Now they both matured. They both molted. You know, they're final molts. Uh, within the last five days. Uh, the female actually has been about a week. The male, it's been about five days. Uh, I was gonna wait a little longer, but I don't I don't really see any point in waiting longer to introduce them. So I'm gonna do that. Um, what I noticed on the internet after I got a couple of these things, actually I started with six, but four I died, uh, leaving me with two because my husbandry skills were not up to par with these things at the time. But fortunately, the two that lived uh, was a pair. And um, what I'm gonna do, I'll turn this around. I really wanna get a, anybody that's watching this is already familiar with what these things look like, but they're just so cool. Uh, they're really pretty and they're big. They're actually, uh, I was impressed with the size because they do get a lot bigger than I was, uh, I was expecting, but I don't want to disturb her too much. What I'm going to do uh, is introduce this male. I'm just going to put the entire piece of bark that he's on in there with her. There he is. But what I noticed after I got these animals was that there's not a lot of information out there on keeping them, you know, as, I mean, there's a lot of random stuff, you know, you know, it's pretty cut and dry about keeping spiders and raising spiders, but when it comes to reproduction, just didn't find a lot on the internet uh, regarding it. Man, he's really sharp. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna stick him in here with her. And, uh, let's get that down in there. Hopefully tonight, we'll see a little bit of action between the two. I hope he doesn't get eaten. Now, that's another thing. You want to, uh, before you do this, you want to make sure this female is well fed. What I did, uh, oh, I put probably a dozen crickets in here with her over the last few days. She's only eaten three or four. Uh, I took out most because they were just kind of disturbing her. But then I left two, and they've gone uneaten, so that tells me that she's not at all hungry. Now watch her go ahead and eat this male anyway. I don't know. But hopefully, now that he's in here, with her, maybe tonight we'll get a little bit of uh, action from the two of them, hopefully.